Park rangers at Lake Mead are gearing up for more than 150,000 people to hit the lake this Memorial Day weekend. Before you go, though, crews have a few things they want you to know. Fox 5's Enzo Moreno is at the lake all afternoon and has more for us tonight. Park rangers make some sort of rescue every Memorial Day weekend without failure. And while they try to get the word out on boat safety, some people just don't listen. When more than 100,000 people hit the lake this Memorial Day weekend, resources for park rangers can be stretched thin. On a holiday weekend when you got a lot of folks out here having those a whole bunch of small little incidents does make it a challenging weekend for us. Park rangers will respond to a variety of different calls on any given weekend, but one issue they have with visitors year after year is flotation devices, but not these flotation devices. Believe it or not, pool toys are one of the biggest contributing factors to drowning on the lake. Regardless of whether it's the holiday weekend or any time of year, it only takes one person with one of those things to have a tragedy happen. The pool toys, you know, they're cute, the flamingos and the unicorns, but they're not a place, they're not items that you want to bring out to the lake here. They're very lightweight. People think that they're great flotation devices, but when the wind picks them up and they float away, then either you're left without that security or you feel obligated to swim after it. And then that once you get out to a certain distance, you become exhausted. And then that does contribute to drownings here at Lake Mead. Park rangers say to leave them in the pool. For the past five years, we have had fathers actually drown on Father's Day. And the scenario is really similar. It is usually related to pool toys or inflatable rafts that their child is on. The child maybe gets blown off of it and then the father swims out to retrieve that item. And then unfortunately the father gets out further than he can handle and has lost his life. Last year, I think we had two different uh, drowning incidents down on Lake Mojave where that was a factor. One thing park rangers want you to do before you leave is check the weather. Most people think they're going to come out here and it's going to be a beautiful sunny day, but you may want to check the weather before you leave because we have had an unseasonably cool May. I'm Enzo Marino, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.